Hey everybody, welcome to another video. I'm here in my local woods. Uh, it's springtime, April 2019, and I'm gonna pitch up tonight. I've got my tarp and my bivy in my bag. I'm gonna pop it up here, I think. Looks like a reasonably good spot. There's a bit of a drop off. You can see the sun going down, but obviously it'll be coming up in that direction in the morning. And I'm really excited because I just wanna catch the light of the sun coming through the bluebells in the morning. Uh, I can't wait, but let's get pitched up before it gets dark. I might get a little fire on, we'll see how we go. And uh, let's make ourselves at home for the night. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to the woods. It's so wonderful to just wake up surrounded by birdsong and the subtle sound of the breeze running through the trees. I slept okay last night. Um, it did rain quite heavily from about one-ish for a good two, three, four hours. Uh, I wasn't too worried. The tarp stood up to it well but I was concerned slightly that I'm on a slope <laughs> and if it got too heavy, it'd probably all run into the tarp. But at the same time, I was like, well, if I get wet, I get wet. So it wasn't too big a problem. <laughs> anyway, um, just sort of waiting for the sun to come up a little bit more and then we'll go film some bluebells. Just love, love, love the bluebells. Just everything about them, from the fragrance to the color, to their shape. To where they grow <laughs> but actually um, I wanted to wait till this morning to share my real reason for being here so five days ago my friend Chalky unexpectedly passed away he was found dead in his home and it was just a massive shock such a <laughs> fun loving caring just all round great guy um, and a good friend and now he's gone uh, some of you guys might recognize Chalky um, a few years ago I first met him when I was doing some sort of research and films into different mental health conditions and how they sort of play out and how nature can help us to handle them and I interviewed him and he talked about his PTSD he was uh, an ex-sapper so obviously in the army and talked openly about his struggles handling daily life with PTSD and yet in the years that I knew him he came leaps and bounds and was an almost totally different guy he's doing so well and that's partly why it's so hard to know that he's gone because he was accessing life so much more and now it's over but um he passed away a few days before we were due to go to the woods. We're going to come out to the woods. We're going to do some whittling, make a spoon <laughs> and just let nature do its thing, cleanse our souls and help us create lasting memories. And I didn't want to not come. Chalky was all about green time over screen time. And he was really helping me to understand myself and the importance of when you feel stuck, or afraid is often not because you're afraid of the actual physical thing but the emotional response on the other side of that and I had a bit of a block to getting out to the woods to bivvying to putting up a tarp to just packing my bag and and he experiences the same 
part of his PTSD and for me part of the anxiety side of, of my mental health is sometimes it's just really hard to get up and get moving but clarity doesn't come through thought it comes through engagement and motivation doesn't come through thought it comes through action <laughs> um, so I managed to get out here with Chalky because he is still here he's in my heart and I know he would have been cracking up over my tarp putting up skills last night <laughs> I have not done this in years <laughs> but it felt good I woke up this morning just grinning and uh, I hope he's proud and it's just so good to be in the woods it's just such a safe 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 space and I know why Chalky loved it so much and I love it so much I think now from whenever I see bluebells and whenever I'm in the woods I'll always think of Chalky I hold him close and uh, yeah we miss you Chalky <sighs> well let's go film some bluebells <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.